welcome to today's video where we are doing something a little bit different to normal um, and something we don't talk about much on this channel but a lot of mountain bikers do which is fitness this is a kind of bike you'd normally associate with a bit more kind of burning calories a bit more normal mountain biking riding up and down hills but that got me thinking how much of a workout actually is an enduro ride compared to let's say something like a session on the dirt jumps or a couple laps of a pump track. So the guys at AmazeFit have challenged us to find out exactly that. What burns more calories? One hour of enduro riding, one hour of dirt jump session, or one hour of pump track shredding. So AmazeFit have sent me and CA their new T-Rex Pro Watch. Da -da, which is their new ultra strong, ultra durable fitness watch, which I think is the perfect watch to find out how many calories we burn today during each session. So we're here at S4P Bike Park for our first power hour. So I'm gonna have to swap this bike out and replace it with this bike. Let's do it. I'd say this is gonna be BMXing. Right, one hour of dirt jumping. Let's go. We've only got an hour, so I'm just going to go straight on the big line for a couple warm-ups and then we'll work on a few tricks and stuff, I guess. Look, heart rate's up to 100. There's warm up there. It's pretty right. I wonder how high the heart rate goes. I wonder if it goes higher if I get scared of doing a big trick later or something. Stay. A few runs down now. We're up at 130 beats per minute on the heart rate. So we're fat burning already, which is good. I'm still on warm up. Still fat, it? just burst. It told me I've done a kilometre of, uh, of biking already. Oh, nice. It's quite cool. No walking, you should be riding back up. It's a realistic <laughs> test, eh? You can't skew the result. Nice. Crowd please and backflip. Crowd please, a backflip, yeah. And that's taken me up to 141 beats per minute, if you can see that. Nice. So we're in our aerobic training area. Even though I'm feeling a bit sketchy today and my 360s aren't going good, the way to get them better is I'm gonna try and 360 every jump. I've done it before, but it's not easy, so that could be a good, uh, good challenge. I was going to say, that was going to take up at least 20 minutes. That was going to take 20 minutes, <laughs> isn't it? Right, what are we going to do now? Oh, I'm a bit dizzy actually. So I'll do an opposite 360 to unwind my dizziness. Woo. Still cruising around a 145 heart rate. Feeling it already. But we've got 15 minutes left. Feeling a bit more warmed up now. Feeling a bit better. I'm going to put the GoPro on. And uh, yeah, film a few runs, try and get my tricks together. Maybe try a few bangers on the last. That'll probably raise the old heart rate a bit. Yeah, let's do it.
banger. Sick run. That was a good one. Stoked on that. <laughs> Up to 150 for that big one. We've got five minutes left. I've always wanted to try and 180 that little small jump. So I'm going to give it a go. It's probably not going to happen, but maybe that'll uh, burn a few calories of scaredness and maybe the crash or two. Don't you let it out. <laughs> Close. Oh, as I suspected, a big crash. Oh. <laughs> Still good to go. <laughs> One more go, one minute left. Yeah! yeah. Oh. On the bike That's one hour. Stop that exercise. Damn. We didn't get it, but we ran out of time. That was a good little power hour as well. Generating workout record. Oh, look. So we're maintaining our aerobic and minor improvements on our anaerobic. We did five kilometers, worked out for an hour. Average speed was five kilometers now, obviously. 25 kilometers now max speed. We burnt 565 calories and the average heart rate was 132 with a max of 136. 163. With a max of 163. <laughs> so, that all sounds pretty good, but until we compare it to the next spot, we don't really know what that means. So we're actually going to hop over to Rogate Bike Park, do an hour there, and see how it compares. Right, here we are at Rogate then on the enduro bike. Probably this activity is what you'd expect to burn the most calories, being sort of endurancey and um, a lot of climbing, a lot of downhill, but we're about to find out. So, I've set it to mountain bike mode, one hour, let's go. So sick. Vixie at 150, 152 already actually. Oh, 15 minutes in. It is quite tiring, the enduro bike. But I'm gonna ride it to make the experiment as accurate as possible. I'm just gonna ride how I would normally ride, do a couple push-ups couple jumps, hit a few turns, do a couple full laps and the results will be uh, real life. Another one on the jump. Oh, right, time for some uh, full laps. I'm going all the way to the top, so see you in a minute.
Right, 40 minutes down. I've actually not done as many laps as I thought. An hour of enduro is not as intense as an hour of dirt jumping. But uh, yeah, gonna go up another track, a few more jumps, I'll do another half lap. And then yeah, then we'll be time to probably go hit the berms. See you in a sec. We have actually five minutes left. So we've come over to round out the last five minutes blasting these epic turns called S berms. So yeah, best get to it, time's ticking. Comes on a very Squeezing in those laps. Three minutes, yeah, no time for chatting. Every time, these turns just do not fail. Uh oh, one minute, it's probably the last lap. Exactly. I'm quite pooped at the end there. Not bad, not bad. That was a good power hour. But actually, yeah, like I said, didn't get as many laps in as I thought it would. What do you reckon, maybe six, seven laps? Let's see what we've done. How's yours? Uh, I've done 1.8 kilometers. You've walked 1.8 kilometers? Yeah. Much further than at dirt jump, so. Yeah. There you go, if you're a filmer, you need to ask for extra rates if you go enduro biking, because it's much harder. Right, here we go, let's see some results. I think we got higher on the aerobic TE, but I think pretty much the same on the anaerobic. Wow. Five kilometers. I think I went a bit further on the dirt jumps. Yeah. That is so weird. But it kind of makes sense actually, because it's quite slow and very steep on the way back to the top, isn't it? And dirt jumps, you just whiz laps the whole time. Average speed for 0.9 k's now, obviously. The jumps as well. <laughs> Max speed here was much higher though, 35 k's. And I did a lot more descent, 339 meters of vertical. And I burnt 568 calories, which is a tiny bit more, right? But it's yeah. super close actually. And I was actually quite pushing quite hard to get those last few laps in. Max heart rate, 163. And the average was 100, 133. Max heart rate is about the same, wasn't it? Was I think it's all, it's all very similar, which is... I actually didn't, ex I didn't know what to expect, but that's super interesting, isn't it? Right, well, let's log that one in. Off to the pump track. So we're back on the NS Decade, back on the hardtail for spot number three of three, which is, <laughs> I've got a feeling, going to be the gnarliest one of all. We're here at the pump track. It's quite a fast, um, sort of bmx style pump track. So we're going to be on BMX mode again. So we'll just start that off. We got one hour. Off we go. Oh, that's a killer of a pump track, actually. So smooth. But um, luckily, it is going to go on YouTube. Would you like to be in the video too? <laughs> well, I think it's too late. <laughs> I think you're in it now. <laughs> There's not many variations, but we can do some challenges. And CA has his bike too make it a bit more exciting. Not much to do except pump. I have never ever completed the full straight manual before. Yeah, I've caught a few of the tree cut my cut my angle out. So. <laughs> right, see you soon. And actually he's come up with his own challenge. Try and go, do, do as many laps you can and just see how high you can get it. Alright, see how far I can get and how tired I can get. <laughs> yeah. And how quick. Doesn't sound that fun really, but rather you than me, see eh? Off he goes. Oh, it's starting to too quick, is it? <laughs> That's pretty long, that one, isn't it? See that. <laughs> how many you got, see eh? Easy, is it? Yeah, 
three, <laughs> three laps. <laughs> Just three laps. Where's the kid? What was your heart rate? Uh, one thirty-four. One thirty-four. It's not, not that high. Oh, it's that uphill bit there. Yeah. It just kills your speed. You're like, oh no. Should we do a few challenges, shall we? Yeah, I went far too hot to start off with. First one is this double here. Um, I'd never done it before, but the fence. All the way over there isn't there anymore, so I can get more speed through the car park. I think I can jump it now. Oh, I wonder if I can do this trick with them somehow as well. Right, last five minutes, see ya. Oh, that turns scary. No. Oh my God, no. No. Yeah! With a minute to go! Ah, uh, it wasn't recording. Ooh. Oh, one hour of pump track in the bag. <sighs> Good effort. <laughs> that's, oh, I'm glad that's the last spot of the day. I'm glad we didn't compare cross country as well. <laughs> that was... So weirdly, I did five kilometers at both other spots, didn't I? Or round yeah. about. Exactly five kilometers once again. This is weird. Let's just that, lie on That the floor. shows that the maximum you can ride in one hour is five kilometers. That is. If we, <laughs> ra if we <laughs> that's, just, that's all I can do. Yeah. There's a lot more hanging out here at the pump track, whereas the other ones are quite flat out. Here's short and intense, and you can only really do two laps at a time before you want to pass out. I think that's maybe why we didn't really burn so many calories. Max speed, 28 kilometers an hour. Not bad, not bad. Oh, and actually no, we still did 486 calories. So, surprisingly, the least calories burnt, I would have expected that to be the most. Max heart rate was 146. Which is very strange. I thought it'd be more than that. How weird. Lucky we did this video, hey? Yeah. And luckily, we don't need to do it again. Because <laughs> now we know. If you want to get fit, go to dirt jumps or go to Rogate. Well, so there we go. What an interesting video. I hope you thought that was. Because we found it interesting, didn't we, Sia? We did. We did. It was very interesting. It was great watching you. Great watching. Do power power good. hours. <laughs> That's a good pun. On that pun, we'll thank Amazefit for their wicked T-Rex Pro. And um, thanks for watching everyone, we'll see you next time. <laughs> <laughs>